What is up you guys, it's me again, back at it again with another video. And in today's video, I'm just gonna be pretty much telling you guys what happened with my car. So, don't drink and drive, don't speed. If you're tired, pull over. Don't drink and drive. About, I'm super late on this video just because I didn't wanna post it. There was a few reasons why I didn't wanna post it. If you guys saw, I believe it's titled uh, Stuff Happens. Um, go ahead and like, check that video out after but um yeah so i believe it was may 14th um a drunk driver fell asleep and crashed into my infinity um it was about midnight uh, i had just gotten home from the gym i just heard a loud boom and um i went outside the guy was sleeping i confronted him with my uh i have a, like I, a flashlight doesn't matter but uh i put it up in his face like not obviously keeping my distance but he was like un not unconscious but uh he was just very like what the hell happened type thing and then uh after that happened he took off running so it was an attempted hit and run i'm not gonna go into full detail but i did i was barefoot it was about a four block pursuit um not gonna say much but point is i brought him back we they Someone brought him back to justice um, at that time all of my neighbors had called the cops already because they had seen me when I got out I was very very upset and uh, I was very upset so I was yelling I was cussing him out after the fact he had cussed me out I'm gonna get COVID tested right now. Let me let me be I'll be back All right guys, I'm back. I got COVID tested really quick. Anyways back to what I was saying someone hit my car They took off running. I took off running Floor blocks, floor blocks, four blocks later, something happened, and then we both calmly walked back to the incident where he had wrecked into my car. After that, it was just a hassle with the insurance. The individual himself, he was uh, undocumented, uninsured, uh, that vehicle was not his. At the time when the foot pursuit ended, he was able to, uh, he got the liberty of, uh, I, I told him you could answer the phone, basically. Um, I don't want to say too much because I don't want to say like anything self-incriminating. You could infer what happened. So at the end of the foot pursuit, he had through his phone or it had fallen out of his hand. Um, so he was receiving a phone call at the time. So that phone call actually very much helped me out because at the time of the, um, at the arrest, so they did the field sobriety test, he obviously failed, um, but he, his family had showed up at my house trying to fight, like after, like they were like, oh, you're instigating this, it's like, what did I instigate? You don't see your car crashed into my car, and they they were just, they were all drunk. Um, the sheriffs, they were very nice. They, they handled the situation very well. But yeah, I mean, he was brought back to justice, which is the good thing. I can't stress enough, like, do not drink and drive, fellas. Like, it, it's just, like, why? Why do you guys do it? It's like, oh, man. But that's the reason for me lagging on these videos of, of the G37. So I hate to say this, but there will be no more G37 content on this channel. As I was saying, there will be no more G37 content as that car is now totaled. Um, the damage, the frame was bent. Um, I mean, I could have kept it, but the way the frame was bent, it's just, uh, I didn't wanna, I didn't wanna keep it anymore. So I, insurance cashed me out on it. Um, and now I have this vehicle. So if you guys, still want to follow me uh that's very appreciated i know i've grown this channel on my infinity so every single one of you guys watching this video if you guys if you guys are even watching this video i appreciate every single one of you guys and it's it's been a journey honestly like starting with zero subscribers to now 400 i would say about 400 and like 20 that's that's what i capped out at like that's 420 subscribers followed me because of either one of my infinity videos that they saw so thank you guys for that and um if you guys want to keep following me i'm gonna build this truck so you guys could stick around enjoy the vlogs um but yeah i mean it just sucks it just very like really really sucks i just wish that this guy would have been responsible and uh not have like been driving drunk and 
this ah, even from so that car had hit my car it didn't even uh what are you looking at i'm gonna do my best to just keep editing this video i keep talking with you guys if you guys take anything away from this video is don't drink and drive like you're i'm sure you've heard this many times and it's it's just don't do it it's like you could that could like forget the car what if someone was walking by my house and they slammed into it and they like killed someone but luckily that didn't happen so but it, there's like that what if factor you guys know like if you comprehend that then it that's good but if you guys can't comprehend that i don't know what what to tell you guys but just main takeaway from this video don't drink and drive you never know what could go wrong I just went over the footage again and there's some points that I missed that are very important. So I got cashed out, which was good. And then I uh, finally got picked up by the tow truck and was sold, I don't know where, at a junkyard. Um, it is what it is, life goes on. But like I'm saying, the main key takeaway from this video is please do not drink and drive. You don't know who you could accidentally hurt. You don't know what you could do to yourself even unfortunately the drunk drivers you guys always survive um and it's always the innocent people that end up passing or getting really hurt um should be the other way around though yeah um thank you guys so much for watching and supporting this channel as you guys know i bought this silverado this is my project truck um this is my gonna be my overland rig i got a few few little things already for it um but more definitely more product like more things coming thank you guys for the continued support i don't want to keep rambling on but if you really stay till this point drop a comment and just be like thumbs up or something or i don't know just comment something and it'll show me some some support so if you guys don't comment anything oh well but yeah thank you guys for watching and i will catch you guys in the next video